everyone, this is Brad at Board Game Geek. I'm here with Brad at Level 99 Games, and we're here to check out uh, BattleCon Online, which uh, I know, uh, I guess, had an earlier release, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, well, it's had a, it's had a long history. We had an earlier release. Uh, we weren't happy with the graphic design or the, uh, you know, basically the interface of it. And so we scrapped our whole client and went back to build it from scratch. And now it is back again, and uh, I believe better than ever. We are really excited about the, grand, the brand new look of the game. And this is a direct port of the BattleCon system onto the online space. So if you play BattleCon in real life, this is an opportunity to play with a few new characters, to play with friends anywhere in the world, and to practice up for tournaments and other organized play events. Cool. Can we take a look at it? Yeah, let's take a look. So the game features a roster of about 12 characters at launch. Um, we're going to continually expand this month by month. Sort of on a uh, like MOBA style schedule where there's a new new hero every month coming out. Uh, characters can also uh, utilize different costumes. So if you want to personalize your character, you can uh, get a different look. The game is fully voice acted, and all of the characters have uh, you know, a uh, complete uh, set of um, fully illustrated cards. So. So you can kind of see the. Um, so we got new art for all the cards um, and you know, a bunch of different things. Um, I w and you can play practice, quick match, or ranked against other players. We're hoping to have a um, versus AI adventure mode as well for this game, so you can delve a bit into the story and the characters of the game. Will the costumes come unlocked, or will you unlock those through play? Or? Some will be unlocked through play. Some will be premium add-ons. So it really depends. We have a few that are like Kickstarter uh, exclusives for those who, who back the projects back when we were first announced it. So, um, but anyway, I will show you how the, how the game works against our training dummy. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. And again, you can't hear it from here, but the game has a full original soundtrack and full voice acting. So, so this is the game interface. My character on the left side here, and my discard piles are here um, above. And then uh, my opponent here and their discard piles. Uh, this is the uh, range track, so I'm currently at range 2 for my opponent. And these are the attacks that I can use in the next round. So in BattleCon, you build an attack by choosing one style, um, which is the left side cards, and one base, which is the right side cards. So if I were to use this advancing strike, I would... Um, let me see if I can... Uh, this. So I would advance one space, and if I move past the opponent, do damage. And then my strike here has a high amount of power and high amount of defense, uh, lower speed. So I'll throw this attack and see what, how it goes. So I attack. My attack shows up here. My opponent will set their attack down. We are able to use antis, which are add-ons that empower our abilities. So, for example, let's try this uh, fire token, which will give me increased power. Um, and I'll just have that. So when you use a token, it pops up up here. You can now see what you what you did and what I'm going to do. The cards merge together once they're played. So you can see my advancing strike once paired up has one damage, eight power, uh, four speed, and five defense. And the eight power is also factoring in the, um, fire. The, the the plus three from fire. Yeah. So it's a complete picture of what your attack is going to do. All right, so I'll just uh, move on. My opponent will pass on anti. Once we both pass, the attacks start activating. So I advanced. I'll attack. Pow. My enemy has soak one, which reduces his incoming damage. That's why you saw seven come out. And then, um, and then I gained some uh, power gauge force, which is used to activate abilities uh, later on in the game. So, and you can see we have a timeline where all the things that happened in this in this round are um, are now visible to us. So the game flows pretty quickly. Uh, the computer handles everything for you, and all you have to do is uh, choose your attacks, and sometimes make a mid a mid beat decision. So, for example, if I have a card that requires a decision, like let's say the sweeping burst, I can go back one or two spaces. Okay. See if this works. He might actually uh, punch me because the dummy does fight back a little bit in this version. Um, well, let's see. So, ready my attack. All right. 
right. So yeah, so he's gonna Getting he's gonna knock me out. But first, I get to retreat. So I can retreat one or two. And in the final game, this will be visualized on the board where I'm about to move. Okay. So I back up two spaces for my burst effect. My jump. And then my bot is going to poke me at range one to four for you know, three points of damage. Kapow. So I become stunned out and don't carry out my move later. And so this is all the, uh, you know, exactly like the tabletop version of BattleCon. Um, anyway, so that's, uh, that's kind of how the game looks at the moment. We do have full ranked play matches working back and forth. You can play against other players anywhere in the world right now. Uh, we don't have internet in here, but you get the idea. Um, and yeah, we're expecting that to come out a little bit uh, later on this year. Okay, and in terms of players who already own BattleCon, is this just an update for them? It does have some new content. We have two new characters that are online only. We're also going to be using online to introduce a few small balance patches to the game to uh, keep the characters more, uh, you know, uh, like on the same power level. If we had a few things in the in the tabletop game that we were thinking of changing, okay. so yeah, so mostly yes, it's going to be an online version for our fans of the tabletop version. Awesome. Well, we'll look forward to it later this year. It seems really fun and a nice take on you know, that BattleCon fighting system. It's been a lot of fun to make and it's a lot of fun to play. So, cool. Thank you so much. Thank you.